On a hot summer night, around 4.33 in the morning, as Jeff the killer took another victim, this time a young wife and also leaving her husband with a massive skull fracture as a result of blood force trauma. The only one to survive was the couple's four-month-old baby that police found co discovered crying in its crib. Alongside the child, police have found a letter which was written on the back of a paper grocery bag in a black Sharpie marker and a Motorola droid faintly illuminated under the baby's blanket. The babysitter, who was locked in the closet during the time, claimed she smelled the lingering odor of women's cheap perfume and found body glitter on the baby's crib. But who was it from? Police were able to decipher the writing on the grocery bag, and here's what it said. Jeff, if you are reading this, now... Know that no matter how many innocent victims you claim or how much innocent blood you shed, I'm still coming for you in the end. All of the men and women you are you so v viciously slaughtered and dis disassembled, I'll I beat you to it. I kill them not because I hate them. I imagine those victims were you as I took their lives. This was the, this was the mere ver vision of you that made me kill them. I never did like you, you greasy-headed, grim, grinning, smug, ignorant son of a gun. My black eyes may look like I'm, I'm void of vision, but I'm not stupid. Just remember, the night that you crept into a poor girl's bedroom, you're going to fall head over heels down the sh down the freaking stairs with your guts caught on the broken glass of the window that I smash you into. Tonight, when I reach you, evil will battle evil. Winner kills all, and the only one who will not get out alive is you. I'm coming. Sleep well. Signed, Jane the Killer. On the droid phone was one of the officers found text in all cops and read with Jane's picture. Below is her face, which she captured on the phone, which is now on your screen now.